Hey, look, <laughs> um, about Tess, I, I don't even know what Here's how this thing's gonna play out. You don't bring up Tess, ever. Matter of fact, we just keep our histories to ourselves. Secondly, don't tell anybody about your condition. They think you're crazy, they'll try to kill you. And lastly, you do what I say when I say it. We clear? Sure. Repeat it. What you say goes. Good. Uh, now there's a town a few miles north of here. There's a fella there that owes me some favors. Good chance he could get us a car. Okay. Let's get a move on. go. Yeah, it'll be faster to go through here. Man. What? Nothing. It's just... I've never seen anything like this, that's all. You mean the woods? Yeah. Never walked in the woods. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Why don't you just take me back to Marlene? If she was up to the task, why'd she drop you off on us? Well, maybe she's better now. Kid, I don't mean to upset you, but your friend's chances of survival weren't too high to begin with. She's a lot tougher than you think. It don't matter. Because I doubt I can get either one of us back into the city in one piece. Trust me. I wish there were some other option. But we gotta find a way to go around. <laughs> fireflies. I mean, real fireflies. Yeah, I see that. Sorry. I lost myself for a sec. <clears throat> you get up here and I'll get a look. You 
Bill. Where do you usually meet him? Huh? Different places. You've never been here, have you? I know this is where he lives, but no, I ain't never been here personally. And that smoke, you think that's him? Sure as hell better be. Well, let's go check it out then. All right, come on. Down here. Just watch your step. It's a good drop. Come here. Give me a second. Nice. Oh, 
shit. It's jammed from the other side. Here, boost me up. No, that's not such a good idea. Well, I can't boost you up. How else are we gonna open it? All right. Give me your foot. <clears throat> now, just open it. Nothing else. <clears throat> sure thing. <clears throat> Careful. Okay. <sighs> Let's see. <clears throat> Okay. Ta-da! Good job. Thank you. So let's see we get a car from this buddy of yours. Then what? Well, then we go find Tommy. Marlene said he's your brother? And more importantly, he was a firefly. He know where to take you. Oh, okay. He lives far from here, which is why we need the car. Hey, look. <laughs> gnomes. Yeah, those are gnomes. Man. I had an art book filled with these. I always thought they were super cute. <laughs> Not fairies, though. They creep me out. All right, man. Did you play this before? No. But I had a friend that knew everything about this game. Apparently, there's this character called Angel Knives who, what was it? She'd punch a hole through your stomach before kicking your head off. <laughs> well, I was never a big fan of these things. I wish I could play it. Mandatory evacuation. Evacuate to where? Where you think? It's a quarantine zone. See, some places got a heads up before the infection showed up. Most didn't. Man, must be hard. Just leaving all your stuff behind like that. That ain't the hard part. Fireflies were everywhere, huh? Yeah, they were. Hoping to restore the country to what it was. Well, <coughs> with a vaccine, maybe they will. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, that's Bill's handiwork. Anybody else live in this town? As far as I know, it's just him. 